Hey guys, Joey66 coming at you from beautiful Superior, Nebraska. And I got a little package in the mail and I want to do a little unboxing with you because it is something for the Dodge Challenger Scat Pack. And I'm very happy that it showed up today. Anyway, let's uh, get to the unboxing and I'll show you who it's from and what we got inside. So the package is from uh, SkyMotorsports.com. And I believe inside there is going to be the new uh, headlight rings that I got for the car. Yeah, as you guys know, a couple weeks back, uh, the other ones got uh, turned up missing, basically. A long story, but if you want to go back and watch that video, you certainly can. But uh, let's get to this unboxing and let's see what we got in here. And as always with my unboxings, I like to use my National Rifle Association knife. Uh, there's some stuff stuck to it. A little tape or something stuck to it. I use it at work a lot, so all kinds of stuff on there, but that's okay. Here we go. Oh, I need to sharpen this thing. It's pretty dull. Nice and sharp before, but I've been using it quite a bit without sharpening it, so. There we go. Close the knife up so I don't cut myself. And let's see what we have inside. Pretty exciting stuff. Ooh. We have some cool little uh, advertisement display stuff with all the stuff that they sell. There's the new logo there that they're using. It's very cool. Anthony's a good guy, and uh, I love the new, uh, the new design there. It looks great. There's a big uh, bunch of cool stuff that they have. You guys should definitely check out this uh, website if you haven't. A lot of great stuff. I hope I'm not holding that too close to the camera. I'm not sure. I'm using the uh, GoPro, uh, actually GoPro clone type thing, so hopefully that's not too close. There's that. A couple more of those it looks like. Oh, some more stuff. Yeah, no, the same things. Cool. Some more of those things. What else could be in here? There's quite a bit of stuff in here. Hmm, I see. All right, awesome. A shirt. That is really cool. SkyMotorsports.com. Nice. A little picture of a Challenger with the uh, cool green headlight green in there. Awesome, man. That is really cool. Thank you so much. Anthony Sky, awesome man. Logo on the front on the little right uh, breast side there. Beautiful. Awesome. And it'll fit me in everything. Sweet. Very cool, man. That's awesome. I love that. I'm going to wear the hell out of that. Definitely. Wow, that's exciting. I'm very excited. That's really, really cool. Oh, we got some decals here, it looks like. Big one and a little one. Again, that's uh, I think that's like his new logo. It looks really, really cool. He makes really good stuff, really cool stuff. And there's some instructions in here for the other stuff that I have in here. So I'll be using those instructions. And a nice business card. It's a good looking business card. Very cool. More stuff on the back of the stuff they sell. Great. Cool. Now, I don't want to show you the really good stuff until later, because we're going to put it on the car and show you, so. But, you got these screens that go behind the uh, headlight rings. Very cool. Keep stuff from getting in there. Uh, they have these in different styles. Different, you can get them painted different colors. And they have the different, uh, I chose the RT pattern here, but I think he has like a honeycomb and something else. So he's got some different uh, options on these screens that go behind. Those are really nice feeling, very, those are like really good quality stuff there. Really good, really nice, I like that a lot. So those screens go back behind, that's pretty damn cool. And I think, since I don't want to tell you what color I got yet on the headlight rings that I ordered, I think we'll go put them on the car, and uh, I'll show you it then, and then you can see what you think. And uh, as you guys know, last time I got some of these type things, I got the orange, uh, I think it was header orange that I got. 
which really clashes kind of it, uh, really with the uh, Octane Red. Uh, but as uh, some of you guys know from the uh, live streams and some of the other stuff I've done on videos, I don't like to match stuff up really on my car. I like to kind of have some uh, really contrasting colors as opposed to uh, as opposed to matching up like Octane Red or something. Which I think that would look good too. But I just kind of like to it to stand out and people. So people ask me like, what is that or whatever. So I, I kind of like that, and that's kind of why I did the uh, the uh, gloss wheels when I got the new wheels for the car. I did the Hellcat replicas, and I could have gotten satin black, but I decided to do the um, uh, the the gloss black because I thought it would contrast nicely with the uh, satin black, uh, you know, other parts on the car. So I kind of like the difference between the two. Kind of doing the same thing here with some different colors. So anyway, let's go put these on the car. I'm very, very excited, guys. Let's see what these look like and you'll see the color here in a minute. guys as you can see we got the green I got the green uh, it's the go green or green go whichever you want to call it I know back in the day it was called green go and he calls it green go um, Scotty Motorsports does and uh, I think now they call it go green to be more politically correct so it's not green go but anyway I thought it looked cool I really like it and uh, you know the orange maybe stood out just a little bit more I'm not sure what do you guys think what do you think of the new uh, headlight rings is those are the Diablo rings from Scotty Motorsports definitely check their website out great stuff over there Great guy, excellent stuff, good quality. Thanks to Scalia Motorsports for sending all that cool stuff. I really appreciate it, and uh, he's a great guy, like I said, and definitely, definitely check out that website. So anyway, there's a little bit more news to report, which I'm not gonna really tell you. It's not 100% for sure, but as some of you may know, we were looking at buying another Prius. You know, we have that Prius besides this Challenger, and uh, we were looking at buying another one, brand new one. We have now changed our mind as of a couple of days ago. We have a new car in mind that is much cooler than a Prius, in my opinion, and I think in most people's opinion. Um, and we will, uh, I'm not going to make a total announcement yet because it's not 100% for sure, and, but I think it's pretty cool and I'm kind of excited about it, uh, much more excited than I would be about a Prius, but uh, like I said, she went along with the Challenger thing with me, so I can't really uh, complain about what kind of car she wants to buy, so she's really into the... Uh, hybrids and electrics and things like that so uh, we're gonna look at some of those but uh, something that's uh, much cooler than a Prius and I'll just say that much if you guys want to guess down below what you think we might be looking at and it might be 99% sure we're gonna buy there goes my uh, stereo there telling me that I have my favorite one of my favorites is on but anyway if you guys want to guess down below what you think we might be getting ready to buy um, give it a guess down below it'd be kind of fun to see what you guys think um, you know, so you kind of know along the lines of what we might be looking at as far as her wanting a Prius really bad. So, and I'll just say that I think it's a lot cooler than that. So comment down below what you think. Anyway, guys, I'm going to get out of here. Hopefully make you a little cool little video out of this when I get home and edit it all for you. And uh, I had a great day today. It's been beautiful weather. Everything's been great here. Hopefully the same has been for you guys. I really appreciate all your support. Please, uh, please subscribe. If you have not, please do so. Just go down there and hit that button. And, uh, don't smash the like button, just lightly hit it because you don't want to break it. So anyway, <laughs> this is Joey66. Really appreciate all of your help, guys, and all of your support for this channel. Thanks a lot, guys, and I'm going to get out of here. i got people staring at me wondering why I'm holding a camera and talking to myself. That's okay. You get used to it after a while. They're still, their heads are still, they're still turning. <laughs> anyway, guys, Joey66, let's get out of here now. I will see you very soon, guys. Thanks a lot.